Testing. One, two, three. You. I sound like a fucking cow. I told you fuckers. I said to you guys. I'm gonna make it on time. I'm Deasha. Alright. So boom. Last episode. Shit was getting crazy. I saw one of the best. Ooh, shit, my chair is falling apart. I saw one of the best transformation like poses in this series for a long time. That Ultra Ego, Ultra Instinct shit was crazy. Gas ain't fucking around. They about to team up on that ass. We about to see how that goes. If you like this video, don't forget to like, subscribe, hit the house bell so you don't miss out on any of our videos. Check out our Patreon and our social media. Damage is nothing but fuel to keep me engaged in this battle, which for you presents quite a dilemma. This dude, Vegeta, knows how to speak. That nigga needs to be a wrestler. He could cut a promo like no other, bro. What now? Would you like to make me even stronger? <laughs> Rawr. <laughs> so he flew in and he duffed him right in his stomach. You know that shit gonna hurt, bro. That shit's definitely gonna hurt. Well, we finna see. And then he kicks him in the face, flies behind him, kicks him in the back of the, or kicks him in the stomach, I guess. And then he bangs his body on the floor. Then he drives his knee all the way down in his, into his abdomen. Look at his face. The, it's weird seeing his face like this with no eyebrows and then the veins. It's crazy. The answer is simple. I'll kill you in... I kill you in one blow and be done with it. Hmm. What did I just say? We're only two pages in. We know what's going to happen. I didn't even read this shit and I know what's going to happen. So, Vegeta jumps up. And then he duffs him in the stomach. <laughs> Gah. <laughs> ah. Gah. Thank you for the prime fuel. But fuck. My thing is, is you're getting fucked doing this, bro. You vermin. And then he hits him again. Hits him with a kick. Punches him in the face. And what is this? Shh. Whoosh. <laughs> what is this? Oh, what? Did he? What? Is he teleporting him? Oh, that's fucking insane. So you... <sighs> so he's like hitting him and then teleporting him right back into his fist and his kick and shit like that. That shit is crazy. He can use instant teleportation on others. That shit is fucking crazy. Enough. Stay back, Kakarot. He's still spitting up blood and shit. There's no way that this is good for your health, Vegeta. Like, we need this to go to the next level. It has to be more than you just getting your ass kicked. Which, when you think about that, that's like a spit in the face to all Vegeta fans. When you really think about it, right? Like, think about it. Really think about it. Vegeta is always losing. Always. They don't give him no dubs. He finally gets a new form. And what does he need to power it up? He needs to lose by getting his ass whooped. And I didn't see that when I when they first like announced it or showed him off. Because I was more so just happy to see Vegeta got a new form. This is the same old shit. Same old shit. He gets strong and the villain he's fighting still fucks him. Look at him. Bleeding everywhere, bro. Yes, with this ideal stimulant, my ultra e ego continues to evolve. Like, on what basis? Like, how do you know? How do you know it's evolving? How do you know? How do you know? Do you feel yourself getting stronger? Because it don't look like it. It just looks like you're getting fucked. But what of your ultra instinct? It seems no different than before. Figure it out fast. Until then, he's mine. I mean, I guess. And he headbutts him. He is putting up a better fight than, like, they were when he first got there. Like, it does look like he's better. But he's rushing in at him and shit. I don't know, bro. 
Okay, so Goku's Ultra Instinct here. My own Ultra Instinct. Oh, he powers down. And then he... F oh. Oh. <laughs> what is he making? A force field behind him? I do look li like how this looks, though. It looks kind of cool. Cease this pointless struggle. Enough of your deranged technique yeah he fuck he looks bad bro look at his eye they just just make vegeta a villain bro don't even like why are we doing this anymore let's make him a villain look at his his eye bro enough no not yet yeesh like some sort of zombie take him down quick gas he's he's, he's punching his clothes off bro have you ever had your clothes punched off you? Not even like punched off like off, but like punched off. Like in this is fucking dumb. I'm not even gonna If you're a Vegeta fan, this shit is ass. It's so dumb. Look at this shit. He's just beating the shit out of Vegeta. He landed on his back or his neck and then rolled over. You won't be standing up again. Look at this shit. As I said, I am no longer bound by limits. <sighs> what? Oh, uh, are you? I guess he burned himself out. That's fine. A technique that damages the user. How stupid. That's funny how he's saying this, bro. He's, he, he's saying it. I was freaking out there for a second. A stupid end befitting a Saiyan. It's... So, Goku uses a force field on him. That's nice, I guess. Thanks for the force field, bro. You saved my life again. And then, oh, you we're lifting him now? Goku has telekinetic powers? That's crazy. What are you up to? <laughs> that force field is crazy. Do you plan to hide behind that shield forever? Emerge now so I may kill you. Phew, okay. Yep, this was my only option, so I might as well try it out. Despite your impending death, you remain carefree. I guess so. That's just how I am. Mm. Okay. Raw. Another form. Silver hair this time or blue. Neither. See, I figured out the best transformation to make use of a power. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. So he, he turned Ultra Instinct, but... He transform again, but what color is this dumb hair now? It's still black. Why? I never thought silver hair indicated maximum strength. I thought silver hair indicated maximum strength. Why not use that? For that ultra instinct to work, I need my heart to be calm and tranquil. Tranquil. But in this form, I could put my emotions to work for me. What? And believe me, my heart's not calm now. He looks just like his father, bro. That shit is crazy. Now look at him. He's bugging. Stop that. That look. No. Don't look at me like that. <laughs> Goku's like, whatever, bro. Oh, shit. That looks like it fucking hurts. That looks like it hurts like shit. He still kind of grazed him. But that shit looks like it hurts. Damn, yeah. He oh, he broke a horn, too? Did he hit him in the... Oh, he did. He did. Damn. That shit looks like it fucking hurt. Damn, bro. He punched the shit. <laughs> he punched the shit out of him. 
he's still going too. I like how fast he is, but I don't understand. I don't understand the Ultra Instinct thing. Like, what about him being calm and shit like that for this, this, this form of it? I don't get it. Damn, he shot the fuck out of him with that. <laughs> how? What is happening? Seems like I'm just barely stronger than you now. But I don't have long, so let's get this done. Oh, okay. Okay. I wonder how long he actually has. Oh, okay, so Vegeta is waking up finally. And he's watching him do the Ultra Instinct thing. This is fucking dumb. Oh, so he kicked him in the chin. <laughs> look at his face. Like, that should look like it pissed him off. And it. Oh, what? Are you serious? That's Goku shooting mouth blasts? All right, curse you. That fighting style is meant to be Ultra Instinct? Abs absurd. Absurd. I sacrificed my pride to become the strongest warrior in the universe. Behold, a, a cretin like you could never hope to surpass me. It's kind of weird that they actually are. This nigga check chucked all of fucking Ten Ten's weapons at him. And then a wrecking ball with a chain? And then Goku catches the shit? A weapon of my own creation could never bring me down. And damn. That looks like he kicked the fuck out of him. Right in your chest, nigga. You eat a dick, nigga. You eat a dick. You was talking all that good shit, so you got kicked in your chest. And that's exactly what happened. He got kicked in his fucking chest. Look at his face. His eyes about to bust out his mouth. Damn, he kicked the shit out of him. Gas. Crap, we might actually lose. Where did I let go? <laughs> hey, Gas, what do you think you're doing? Why did I make you into the strongest warrior? Answer me. To elevate the heaters to the universe's greatest organization. Correct. And what is needed to achieve that must kill the Saiyans. That's crazy. Wrong. You have to kill Frieza. Oh, stomp, stamping out the Saiyans was only a stepping stone along the way. That's crazy to think about. So find a resolve to die in battle if you have to. The power I gave you has, has to be worth more than this pathetic showing. That's crazy. He was actually putting in work. Yeah, that's too harsh. Don't push him too hard. Hey, you. Don't force the guy like that. If he wants to fight us again, we're up for it whenever. This guy. Shut up, Saiyan. Word. Shut up. It won't be a next time. <laughs> What's that mean? Oh, shit. He turned into Moro. And he got his, his horns back. What's up with your face? I think you see what I mean. Oh, that's it? He chopped his ass, bro. I'm not, um... Not too pumped about this one. They were on a hot streak with the last few chapters, but this one was kind of cheeks. I just, I just feel like, I feel like you ran out of ideas of what to do with Vegeta. The problem is, is that there's plenty of things you could do with Vegeta. And you don't have to do the same thing over and over again. Give him a power up to the main villain. The main villain still fucks him anyway. And then Goku comes. Like, I get it. It's the Goku show. I'm always going to know it's the Goku show. But find another way for him to sit out of the battle instead of, like, beating his ass. Because you get us all hyped for a new form. Then you just beat his ass. And then you make the form him getting his ass beat. Like, that's... It's... It's it's dumb. And then this nigga Gas getting a whole new power-up, bro. Like, are you, are you sacrificing your life's energy? Because Goku was fucking you. So now Goku goes... Not necessarily to a new level, but he figures something out to beat this guy. Convincingly. And he gets another power up. So what the fuck does that mean for us now? What does that mean? Oh, guess what? You got to wait another month. You got to wait a month. You waited a month for this. You got to wait another month for that. That shit is crazy, man. At least, like, let us see up until what Goku has up his sleeve. Like, why do we have to fucking wait? Why we got to wait a month? Why did you leave it out this way? Let's finish it. Not even finish it. Just, like... You know, like, just give me a little more. Don't leave it like this, bro. Like, it's just not. 
I don't know. I'm a Vegeta fan. Frieza's my favorite character, but I'm a Vegeta fan, bro. And they just be doing us dirty. That nigga's on the ground somewhere fucked off. And it's like, how many times you gonna diss this character? Like, we know what he stands for. We know all of that shit. He wants to take care of his family and all that shit. But you just keep dissing this character. There's no reason why somebody like Vegeta, who trains probably more than Goku, like, why shouldn't he get a form and be able to, like, benefit? Like, he might benefit in the future, but he didn't benefit in this fight because he was getting fucked. And even he, even he was saying he has no limits and shit like that. He's not bound by limits, and he's just bound by, like, damage and, like, to me, that's dumb because I just keep getting fucked until I get knocked out because if I get stronger, but I still can't like beat you, then what the fuck is the point? This shit is so dumb to me. Maybe he has to eat like a blast or something like that in order for him to like actually like power up because I didn't see no power up from that. He was just getting fucked. But that's my opinion, man. You guys let me know what you think. Don't forget to like, subscribe, hit the hell's bell so you don't miss out any of these videos. Comment down below. I really want to know what you think. Like. There's no need to flame anybody. Like, my opinion is my opinion. It ain't going to change no matter what anybody says. So, just let me know what your opinions are. I want to hear, like, how do you feel about this chapter? Because I thought it was it was kind of ass, to be honest. We didn't really learn nothing. We learned Goku still has Ultra Instinct. We learned Vegeta still gets fucked. And we learned that Elect has a new... Gas has a new form. And they want to, we knew they wanted to kill Frieza, but he has a new form and it looks like it's using his life force. So, ah, who knows at this point? We got to wait till next month. Anyway, yeah, do all that shit at the bottom. I'll see you in the next one. Peace. Shit is ridiculous.